Welcome everyone to MemeC. In today's MemeC video, I will be showcasing and showing you how to get every single accessory inside of MemeC. So I'm going to be showing you how to get every single accessory that you see on the screen right now, starting with the Egg Dodge. The Egg Dodge is a common accessory. The health does give you 750 the defense is 5%, the weapon damage is 10%. So this is the accessory right there showcased, as you can obviously see. If you want to go ahead and get this accessory, you actually get this accessory by coming over here and defeating the water dog. Whenever you do defeat the water dog, there is a small chance of you getting the accessory that I've got right now. So that's how to get the accessory that I've got right now. This is what it does look like, as you can see, looks really really cool. Let's move on to the next accessory. We now move on to the flopper hat. The flopper hat accessory does give you 500 extra health, as well as 5% extra melee damage. If you want to get the flopper hat, you get the flopper hat by going ahead and defeating the big flopper. The big flopper is over here, as you can obviously see, by defeating that flopper, the big flopper, you can actually go ahead and get yourself the accessory, which is flopper hat. This is the flopper hat, it looks like a cube on your head, looks pretty cool if you ask me. And now we move on to the next accessory, which is the giant banana. The giant banana accessory does give you health regen, melee damage and a melee cooldown. If you want to get the giant banana, I'll show you how to get it right now, but this is what it does look like, as you can see. And if you want to go ahead and get it, go to the Gorilla Island. And once you do go to the Gorilla Island, what you basically want to do is go ahead and defeat the Gorilla King. So the Gorilla King is right over here, as you can obviously see. Whenever you do defeat the Gorilla King boss, there's a chance of it dropping the giant banana accessory. We now move on to the sus phase, which is one of my most funny, funny, well, it's by far one of the most funniest looking accessory out there. So the sus phase accessory does give you 666 health. It does give you a power damage boost by 10% and a power cooldown by minus 10%. This is what it does look like. It's something you'll see in your dreams if you have a nightmare. But yeah, what you want to do is go to the snow island and once you do go to the snow island, you will see the sus face right here. Defeat the sus face and there's a small chance of you going ahead and getting yourself the sus face accessory. So that's how to get the sus face accessory. We now move on to the pop cat. So the pop cat pet accessory is a accessory that you can get from raid. So if you do go to the Mr. Beast Island, you can actually go ahead and get this item from raid. So it does give you a power damage boost up to 15% as you can see, weapon cooldown by 10% and walk speed plus 5. Very overpowered if you ask me. If you want to see what it does look like on your character, this is what it does look like. It's basically like a little cat on your shoulder which is pretty cool as you can see. I really do like that. And you get it from raid. So whenever you do complete a raid, guys, there's actually a small chance of you actually getting it. So if you do complete your raid, guys, of a raid island where I am, you can actually get the pop cut pet. So that's how to get the pop cut pet in MemeC. We now move on to the next accessory. So the next accessory that we've got is the Rick Buddy. The Rick Buddy accessory does give you a melee cooldown, weapon cooldown, as well as a power cooldown. So it gives you, that is quite overpowered guys, but if you want to get this guys, you got to defeat the Rickroller, the Rickroller is right there as you can see, looks kind of ugly man, but yeah this is what it does look like, and it gives you like a ton of weapon cooldowns, etc etc, now we move on to like the worst accessory out there, I think anyway, the Mr Beast one, this is what it looks like, it's a little bit too big, as you can see, and you get by defeating Mr. Beast. If you want to see the stats, the health is 777, XP boost 10%, and it also gives you a money boost. The only problem is that it's a little bit too big. But we now move on to the Mawai head. 
So for Mawai Head, it's actually going to be in the Mawai Island. And you got a defeat for Mawai Head boss. As you can see, this is the Mawai Head. Once you do defeat it, there's a chance of you getting the head, as you can see. This does give you a ton of health, 2,500 health, health regen, and defense. So it's basically a defense accessory. But we now move on to sus powers. So the sus powers accessory looks like this, as you can see. And you get it from the Forgotten Island. So um, the sus powers accessory does give you health, melee damage, weapon damage, power cooldown, and instinct dodge. So very overpowered, not gonna lie, one of the best accessories out there. Make sure you go ahead and get it. If you want to get this, you gotta kill Lord Sauce. You get you, to kill Lord Sauce you need a saucy orb, as you can see, and you actually get saucy orbs by defeating red sauces. So you can defeat red sauces over here. But we now move on to the next accessory. So the next accessory is going to be the pumpkin head. As you can see, we both got the pumpkin head. If you want the pumpkin head, go to the pumpkin island. And you actually get this by defeating the pumpkin boss. So in order to defeat the pumpkin boss, you gotta get scary scores. Where you want to kill scary scores and there's a chance of you getting a flame orb, as you can see. So flame orb right here, once you get a flame orb spawning, the pumpkin boss as you can see with a flame orb that you've got um the pumpkin head does give you a health regen speed boost and a health boost we now move on to my best accessory in the entire game the noob friend accessory which gives you a health boost defense boost melee damage boost power damage boost melee cooldown oh my days this is the best accessory in the entire game i don't care what you guys say it gives you a ton of boost and it is a must-have accessory inside of Memesy. So you get this, guys, by defeating the Mawai head boss and getting a new pad. Get a new pad from the Mawai head boss. Soon as you do that, what you want to do is use the new pad inside of here. And then once you use the new pad inside of here, what you want to go ahead and do is actually go ahead and teleport to the Forgotten Island. My bad, you don't need to come here. You want to make your way over here, guys, as you can see. So, yeah, the evil noob boss does spawn on this area right over here. This is where the evil noob does boss in the noob arena. And by defeating it, you can actually get this accessory. Thank you for watching. That's how to get all of the accessories, as well as all of the accessories showcased in Memesy. Peace out.